YouTube. I should just get straight into it. What's up, YouTube? Today I'm going to be doing a makeup. What's up, YouTube? Today I'm going to be doing a makeup. Oh, a makeup. Doing a makeup. What's up, YouTube? Today I'm going to be doing a makeup look, a makeup tutorial on this look. If you'd like to see how I achieved it, then stay tuned. So for my eyebrows, I use Rimmel. For my eyebrows, I use Rimmel London. It's called Brow Shake Filling Powder in colour dark brown. It's really cool. You just like shake it and then it's like just like a powder on a little stick thing. It's really, really simple and easy to apply. Maybe you should like blow the stick before you put it on your eyebrow because I just put a hefty amount on just then. Um, yes, yeah, so I just go, just line the bottom of my brow, and then line the top of my brow, and shape it a little bit. But the concealer does most of the work for me with the shaping, because um, one thing about this is that it's it's easy to apply, but it's not very neat. So if you're one of those people that likes to fill in your eyebrow very neatly. And not have to do much work with the concealer this probably isn't the product for you but with me i shake my eyebrows with the concealer Concealer, I use LA Girl Pro Concealer HD High Definition Concealer in colour Pure Beige. And I just go straight onto my brow with the brush that's already on the concealer. One thing about this concealer is that it finishes really quickly. Or maybe I just use too much of it, but I feel like it's almost finished. I only bought it a few weeks ago. So yeah, I just go around my brow, like so. And then I just take my angled brush, take my angled brush and I shape my brow. Sometimes when I squeeze too much concealer out, I then just use the excess on like little spots that I have, little pimples that I have. Conceal those over and then I'll blend them in later with my um, beauty blender. Just so that no product goes to waste. I know they say your eyebrows are meant to be sisters, not twins. But these two don't even look related right now. Like, what's going on? They look like bloody brother, brother and uncle rather than sisters. So for foundation, I use Kiko. Kiko. For foundation, I use Kiko Milano Universal Fit Hydrating Foundation Fondetaint, whatever that means, in colour Natural 100. I just go straight onto my face with the foundation. Put like a little few blobs on my forehead. 
on my cheeks, on my chin and on my nose. Okay, so then I use my brush to blend this all into my skin. And I just rub half my eyebrow off while I'm doing that. What on earth? Run. This foundation is actually quite a good match. Well done to the lady in Kiko. If you get that neck bit, can't be going out looking like you've got a mask on. Make sure you blend all the way down. Has <laughs> eyebrows so sharp? Stab my ex with that. I'm coming across a very ghetto in this video. I'm not ghetto, I promise. Highlight again. I use. Um, LA Girl Pro Concealer in colour pure pure beige. I actually can't talk today, it's really getting on my nerves. And I just put that under my eyes when I actually have some product. Under my eyes, on my forehead, on my nose. On my chinny chin chin. Today's eyelashes are from, give me a drum roll please. Primark. Yes, they're from Primark, but I saw them and I was like, wow, they are so pretty. So I had to pick them up. Um, they are in the style Dubai. They are absolutely gorgeous. Now you guys can witness the struggle um, that I go through to put eyelashes on. Why am I even doing a makeup tutorial? Like, who even do I think I am? Where are my um, tweezers? Where are my damn tweezers? I need them. I forgot that I put my <laughs> eyelash glue and tweezers in my handbag on um, Saturday when I went out because I was scared that my eyelashes were going to fall off so I uh, took the products with me just in case. So for mascara I use MAC Zoom Waterfast Lash. Just put a little, little, little bit of that on. Here goes nothing. I take my damp beauty blender and I blend out this baby. Girl, you gotta blend, blend, blend like your life depends on it, honey. Girl, you know you better watch out. Some guys, some guys are only about that thing, that thing, that thing. I got bronchitis. She said. <laughs> oh dear. Ooh. I'm looking kind of white still. Uh oh, oh, honey. For my contour, I use. MUA Pro Base Cover and Conceal Kit. I use the darkest um, colour on the palette, obviously, as you can see, because I've rinsed out that dark brown. 
but um, yeah, I use that to conceal. To contour with. I just go like that. And then I go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. On my forehead. A little bit on my jawline. On my nose. And then I blend that with my damp beauty blender again. We gotta blend it. We gotta blend. Like a lot of parents on it. You stupid. Don't no, not. My arms hurt him. I just Dagged, dagged, dagged. My eyelash came off. So I poked myself in the eye. Because I like my contour to be quite sharp, I go over it again with um, MUA Luxe Bronze and Sculpt Contour Kit in colour medium to dark. I take the brown and I put it on my brush just like that. Blow it off. <sighs> Basically, just blew all the product off. Didn't mean to do that. <sighs> and then I go like this. Make a fishy face. Like so, then I get my Revolution Luxury Powder, Banana Powder, to set my highlight. I just take a brush, I put a little bit in the lid. I think a bit too much. I just dab it in with my brush, blow it off a little bit. And then I just go ahead and just set wherever I put the highlight. Dust! <laughs> Anybody? Dust. Anybody? No. Dust. I probably shouldn't be so heavy handed with these products because I just got it all in my damn eyebrows again. And all over my top, like I'm never doing a makeup tutorial ever again. Why lying for? For my eyes, I'm just gonna do something really simple today. Basically. Gonna use the MUA Makeup Academy Professional Palette um, called Silent Disco. It's their like really colourful one. And I'm just gonna take the pink shade or red shade. Just for a little bit of colour. So I do a little bit of that, just like that, and I get all the eyeshadow inside my eyes and now I can't see, Lord Jesus. Time for the highlight, boo. Little bit of highlight. For my highlight, I use Revolution Strobe Highlighter in color Gold Addict. And we'll just use a little bit of that.
to line my lips i'm going to use this brown lip liner from primark from primark in color toffee i absolutely love it it's my favorite it's only 90 pence in primark or actually i think it might be one pound now And then to fill in the middle, I'm going to use my mum's lipstick. Hi mum. Yes, I have your lipstick. It's brown. It's from Avon. And it's really cute and it goes really well with um, the toffee colour. I love me some brown. Ow, bit my tongue. Ouch. So that's my face done. I just need to um, set it. To set it, I use Revolution Pro Fix Illuminating Fixing Spray. And girl, you gotta shake that bottle. And then I just spray it like so. And then you gotta let it dry. I went to the hairdressers on Saturday morning and I asked the lady to trim my ends because I had a lot of split ends and um, I think she got a bit scissor happy because a lot of the length of my hair has gone. So auntie, if you're watching this, next time I say cut, I mean next time I say trim, I mean trim, okay? Please don't get scissor happy girl because you took my length away girl. It took me a long time to grow that out and you took it away. Um, slick this side of my hair down. Gotta slick those baby hairs, hunty. watching guys if you like this makeup tutorial give it a thumbs up if you'd like to see more makeup tutorials on my channel then comment below don't forget to click that subscribe button so you don't miss any of my videos and I shall see you in my next video bye